Hi, I'm Jenna Lynn Roberts with Present Path Tarot, and today I just want to talk about the Lover's Card. Love! Woo! Um, the Lover's Card is a funny one because it represents our relationships with those who bring us fulfillment, but it also represents our own wholeness within. So, you know, you have two people here, a very Adam and Eve scenario, and on one side you have her with the Tree of Life and him with a, a burning bush. And over them is this angelic, um, I mean, angelic angel, <laughs> who has the sun behind them and a wreath upon their head, and there's this kind of calling together of these two people. I like to think of the lover's card as not just for love, but for any relationship that you have. It can be to your work. It's any relationship that brings you a state of fulfillment, a state of true inner sanctuary. And um, for me, this card has a lot to do with wholeness and allowing yourself to be fully yourself. Another thing this card does, though, is it taps you into the karmic lesson that you must experience through another person. Relationships are hard, and a lot of times you have to learn lessons in this lifetime that reflect from maybe past lives, reflect from um, divine intervention. So in a sense, I see that angel as kind of pushing these two people together because they both need to learn from each other. And that's not always a long-term thing. You could see it as a soulmate card, but I see it as a um, divine desire to put you together with this person to shake up your world and to bring you into a state of more clarity of who you are and your authentic whole self. So that's one way to look at it. Um, I'm curious what your ways of looking at the lover's card is and um, how you would like to access your whole self and what details would fulfill your whole self. So having a career in something that's highly fulfilling for me, reading Tarot is a lover's card experience. I feel it's calling and I, I feel really my high, I feel like I'm in my higher self when I read. Um, and your hobby, your art can also be a lover's card experience. Schooling and something can be that. Anything can be. So breaking out of the relationship limitation and into a wider perspective of what really true love is about, which can be a connection to all kinds of aspects of life. So um, please comment on how you read the lover's card and what interpretations I'm missing here in this short video. Thanks so much for joining and feel free to subscribe to my page. And uh, if you go to presentpathtrocom slash readings, you can get a um, PDF about the minor arcana mailed to you as you join. And I hope you'll continue watching more videos to learn more about the tarot. Enjoy your journey into the esoteric fun of learning all these archetypes.